San Francisco's Union Square is beginning to look like the city's permanent floating flea market. The street peddlers are out in force, and it's not only here. They're on Fisherman's Wharf, in front of Girdelli Square in the Cannery, and on fashionable Union Street. They have no permits, but they don't need any, under an injunction issued by a Superior Court judge six weeks ago. It's all tied to a case that went to court today, where the Street Artists Guild is challenging the police permit procedure and the Board of Permit Appeals. The trial is expected to last till Monday or Tuesday, and until then, the injunction stands. The lawyer carrying the case for the street artists is Robert Cantor, and he thinks his case looks better and better. Uh, I was very pleased with uh, the testimony of Chief Scott, uh, which indicated at least uh, preliminarily that there is a standing policy to deny the permits, which is the basis of my contention in this lawsuit. What is the, uh, the route that you're going to be going over the next uh, several days in, in uh, trying to win this case for the Street Artists Guild? Well, I will be attempting to establish as testimony before the court that there has in fact been a systematic and arbitrary denial of the permits, both by the police department and by the Board of Permit Appeals when we appealed the denial from the police department. If you win your case, what will be the net effect on peddling on the streets of San Francisco? Well, I trust that immediately after we win the case, there will be even a greater influx of street artists uh, on the street. However, I have already proposed to the Board of Supervisors legislation which would restrict the number of street artists who are allowed to sell in San Francisco and certainly would not allow sellers of commercial goods to sell on the streets. Chief Scott, why is the police department policy not to grant peddlers permits in the city of San Francisco? Well, we grant permits in certain areas, but we certainly we don't grant permits where the effect upon the community is deleterious, it blocking the uh, sidewalks, causing congestion, uh, interfering with the uh, safety of people on the streets. And this particularly uh, applies to uh, the Fisherman's Wharf area and the cannery and, and Girdelli Square? Yes, sir. Chief, will there be any change in, in the police policy regarding the street peddlers who are operating without permits while uh, this trial is in motion? No, not until we get a ruling from the court. So that the, the, uh, the situation will continue as it has for, for the last sub several weeks and that they'll be permitted to go on selling. The police will not interfere. Yes, that's correct. The ramifications of this case are very broad indeed. If the decision does go in favor of the street peddlers, the whole question of police permit procedure, as well as the powers of the Board of Permit Appeals, could be on the firing line. Ed Arno for Eyewitness News in San Francisco's City Hall. Different people to be 